Why is Christchurch seemingly the centre for all these tremors? Well, I mean, as as the as you said, the first one happened in September 2010. Um, up until that point, no one knew that um, there was such a um, uh, there was a risk really to Christchurch. Everyone, the focus certainly over the years has been on a, a major earthquake, either going down the Southern Alps and taking out the tourist town maybe of um, of Queenstown up to, up to the top of the um, North Island uh, of the South Island of Nelson as well, sort of along that Southern Alps route, and also at the bottom of the North Island Wellington, which is known to be on a major fault line as well. But certainly um, there was never any. Oh, I'm sorry, we're just having a major earthquake. I've, I've got to go. I've got to go. I've okay, got to go. you go. You get yourself to safety. Oh, for um, well, as you heard there, um, our reporter Belinda McCammon in the middle of another shake. I'm not sure if that was an aftershock. It was an actual shake. We'll try and get hold of her later on, and we will bring you news of her. Um, situation and indeed the situation we'll get news from there just as soon as we can but let me just uh, remind you what happened as we were speaking to Belinda McCammon there of New Zealand TV there was another shake just as we were speaking to her this is um, a really interesting across the UK this is BBC Radio 5 Live up all night So let's move on. Let's get uh, the week's medical news now from our doc, uh, GP Raj...